So from the workbench area coming out, um, like I said, the other thing pointing out drains and stuff throughout, so you're not looking at having a flood of water in the rainy season. But more wood out here. And like I say, just going around showing you what else we have here. Coming into building number two, but before we do that, we'll come back here. You can see you've got your conduits for electricity and stuff like that. You've got water here as well. You've got covered storage back here as well for parking. So additional areas behind the home. Come back this way a little bit for you. You can see we're covered under here as well. So basically pretty efficient about everything being used. You can see we've got additional lumber stored here as well. Coming around, you can see we have another fifth wheel here. Yeah, we hid one from you. And uh, as you can see, we've got the uh, heat pump slash cooling fan here, thermo zone. But like I said, if you run in home business, you're not worried about coming out here and having stuff overlapped so bad that you don't enjoy what you own. So let's take a look at the last building, shall we? Coming in, back to the front, open up. Here we go. So let's take a look at what we have here. Welcome to the man cave. Hate to say it that way, but as we look on the walls, you can sit there and see, sometimes you just gotta have that little retreat. Definitely wired, definitely heated. So let's, let's come around, let me pan around for you. Another electrical box of its own out here. You see we've got a lines running for the uh, compressor for air. We'll come around this way. Room for the bike. Room for the ATV. Let's pan around here. Definitely room galore in this thing for coming out here doing things. So if you're running a shop out of the home, um, I'll put it like this. This is beyond being a shop. You've got a three-quarter bath out here. So that's really nice. You turn around and have a sink. So you have full functioning, all utilities. You can see the control head for this. Come around. Let's go upstairs. As we go upstairs, this has been used as an office, is what's currently being used at. So I'm going to go ahead and pan around, and here we go. So like I said, the business opportunity here, if you want our home business is, is great. I know a lot of people who run into home business, you know, we're talking overhead and expense. And, you know, nowadays in our current markets, the fact that, um, you know, office space is not cheap and it, it's really wanted to be had. You can definitely see that this is just kind of a drop the furniture, your home, turn the key, you're in. So, you know, like I said, the 3,400 plus square foot for the house, when you leave here and go home, you're home. And as far as if you want your toys, got your toys, room for that too. When you turn around and you need somewhere to sit there and run the home business, as you can see, that is an oversized door right there as well. But you can see that when you want to sit here and come out and tinker in the shop, you can do everything on your own property. Uh, only thing missing is a lift. Bring your own, plenty of room. So I want to sit there and once again, say thank you guys for coming out with me to check out Triwood Realty's latest luxury listing out here in Auburn, Washington. 3,400 plus square feet, three big bedrooms, two bonus rooms, four bathrooms, three car garage, 10 acre lot. You got mountain views, territorial views, room for the toys, RV, the whole works and more. So if you want more information or have questions, uh, just look below the video and all the contact info is there. We look forward to hearing from you. Have a good day.